Tesla CEO Elon Musk says he tested positive and negative for this virus, the COVID-19 that is going on and calls it bogus. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from Te TorqueNews.com. If you are here for the first time, please subscribe to our channel and ring the notification bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. So we have had a lot of questions about this virus. I don't want to name it that has been going on and bringing our lives upside down around the world and so on. And now... Tesla founder and CEO Elon Musk said in a tweet that he has tested both positive for this novel uh, virus and tested negative, offering a skeptical view of the validity of the procedure of testing. In a series of tweets early Friday this morning, Elon Musk said he had conflicting results from rapid anti-gene tests for COVID-19 after he had mild sniffles and cough and slight fever, fever in recent days. So here's what he said. Something extremely bogus is going on. Was tested for COVID, for COVID four times today, he wrote. Two tests came back negative two came back positive positive same machine same tests same nurse wow this brings questions for me too how can this be possible has this ever happened to any one of you who are re uh, hearing this report musk who earlier this year dismissed concerns about this virus and fought lockdown orders in california to have the fremont factory open said he planned to take the more accurate pcr test which must be sent to a lab for analysis the rapid anti-gene tests have gained ground in recent weeks, reports uh, France 24, of backlogs at laboratories, but they are less sensitive to small amounts of virus and more likely to deliver a false negative. This is reported by France 24, an uh, official uh, Agence, France, Agence France Press. In March, Elon Musk appeared to dismiss concerns about this virus, saying that he's in his in my guess uh, in my guess is that uh, my guess is that this panic will cause more harm than virus. Two months later, he defied lockdown orders in California to reopen the Tesla assembly plant, daring authorities to arrest, uh, arrest him. Musk is 49 years old, and uh, so, like I said, his, his symptoms is he's questioning. Musk travels regularly on his private jet between work sites for Tesla and rocket company. He runs Space Exploration Technologies Corporation, SpaceX. Recently, in fact, he was in Giga Berlin in Berlin um, trying to speed up the process of going uh, of uh, building Giga Berlin so it doesn't slow down and also um, personally interviewing on site some uh, engineers. He's um, playing touched down, like I said, in Berlin, I think it was last week or so, Germany has been struggling to contain a second wave of the virus and this month uh, closed bars, restaurants and leisure facilities, which um, uh, while keeping some businesses open and uh, reports Bloomberg saying Chancellor Andrew Merkel's government has urged citizens to keep social contacts to a minimum and avoid non-essential travel. Tesla was forced to temporarily uh, halt work at its just opened plant near Shanghai, if you remember this earlier this year, uh, though it was the shutdown of its main uh, factory in the United States that stuck uh, the controversy, not the one in China. The company resisted uh, idealing the facility on uh, idealing the facility until local officials called the facility in Fremont, California, to public health risk. Musk then um, ranted about the shutdown orders, calling them fascist and undemocratic. After the California country where uh, county uh, where the Fremont factory is located, the Alameda County initially told Tesla it couldn't reopen. The company sued, and the CEO threatened to relocate. The Tesla's headquarters operations to other states such as Texas. Um, production then restarted before the county gave the go-ahead and the uh, suite was later dropped against the county from Tesla. Uh, Tesla emerged from the shutdown on a tier from 
a stock market perspective displacing toyota motor corporation in july to become the world's most valuable automaker while the company reported record quarterly vehicle deliveries last month it's acknowledged it will be difficult to reach its target to hand over 500,000 cars to customers this year toyota and volkswagen ag by comparison sell more than 10 million vehicles annually now that's big test a target for tesla to build um, to deliver uh, that tesla deliveries must top 180,000 in the fourth last quarter to meet the 500,000 goal do you think guys tesla in this fourth quarter can deliver 180,000 vehicles to make uh, 500,000 who knows it's possible it, it's the end of the year it's end of the quarter tesla has been increasing its um deliveries each month and also uh, uh, each quarter in the past three four quarters and uh, there is more growing interest in electric cars so it may be possible but it's a big tall order to reach elon musk wrote that the rapid anti-gene tests he had taken were from bd likely referring to beckton dickinson and corporation the company received emergency use authorization from the u.s food and drug administration in july the regulator said that the test is designed to detect bits of the virus nucleocapsid antigens, the proteins that surround the virus generic materials in nasal swabs from people who are suspected to have COVID-19 within the first five days of the ans um, onset of symptoms. Positive results do not rule out bacteria infection or co-infection with other viruses, the agency said. Negative results should be considered presumptive, do not rule out the uh, possibility of a virus infection and should not be used as the sole basis for treatment or patient management decision. So Elon Musk also this morning wrote that if it's happening to me, it's happening to others also. I'm getting PCR tests from separate labs. Results will take about 24 hours. So I guess we'll wait uh, to hear Elon from Elon Musk tomorrow um, if he is taking the test today sometimes tomorrow or next day to see what uh, results are happening so it may be then possible that most a lot of people who have taken this test may have a false positive or false negative uh, although no diagnostic test is perfect pcr tests are considered the gold standard in terms of accuracy reports bloomberg i will have the uh, link to bloomberg's report in the description of this video um, bloomberg also says they look for tiny bits of the virus nucleic acids in a person's sample but they also have drawbacks what are the drawbacks they are highly technical expensive and typically take many hours of days for someone to receive results so being expensive will not be a problem for elon musk technical probably also will not be a problem for elon musk we just have to be patient and uh, wait to see the results in the next day or the next few days speaking of tesla executives they have something very important coming up uh, as Tesla ramps its effort to acquire more resources for its battery production initiatives, Indonesian President Joko Widodo has revealed that he is sending a high-level delegation to meet with the electric car makers Tesla's um, top executives next week. The talks will likely involve a potential battery facility deal in Indonesia, a country that stands as the world's largest nickel producer. In a statement to Reuters on Friday, the president of Indonesia, better known by his nickname Jokowi, stated that the trip will be part of Indonesia's promotion of its omnibus job creation law, which is aimed at simplifying how companies can do business in the country. The omnibus initiative harmonizes 79 existing laws, significantly cutting red tape and potentially spurring investment from interested business. The delegation that will be meeting with Tesla executives such as Elon Musk next week will include high-ranking officials with the team being led by the coordinating minister of maritime affairs and investment luhut panjiatan it's very important because we have a great plan to make indonesia the biggest producer of lithium batteries and we have the biggest nickel reserve jokovi said
So, but we don't know if this, if, if Elon Musk has uh, this virus, if the new test confirms, I don't know if this uh, meeting will come to fruit, uh, fruition or maybe Elon Musk may meet uh, Indonesian officials in a remote way and maybe some other top executives from Tesla will be there at the meeting. So we'll see. We just have to be patient with this, friends. Let me know what your thoughts are. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. Friends, have a wonderful rest of the day. God bless you, everyone. Peace be with all of you and I'll see you soon. Take good care of each other. Have a blessed day.